Your credit score is a report card for how you handle money. It's a three-digit number that tells lenders how likely you are to pay money back. A good score could get you better interest rates on a mortgage or a car loan. A weak score could cost you more for both. Credit scores generally range from 300 to 850. 720 and above is considered good. 620 and below is a sign that you've had trouble paying money back. A bank may reject your application for a new loan or a credit card or charge you much higher rates. There are three major U.S. credit reporting agencies, Experian, TransUnion, and Equifax. They keep track of everything that affects your credit. Their reports go to an analytics company such as the Fair Isaac Corporation. The Fair Isaac Corporation generates a three-digit FICO score. Here's how. 35%, the biggest part of your score, is based on your payment history. So if you want to boost your score, the first thing you should do is pay on time or even pay early. 30% of your score is based on how much credit you use. The less available credit you use, the better. Maxing out your credit cards will cost you here. 15% is the length of your credit history. The longer, the better. 10% is the type of credit. You get points for having a mix of credit cards, mortgage, and other loans. Another 10% is new credit. Opening several new cards in a short period of time can ding your score. You usually have to pay to see your credit score, but you can get a free copy of your three credit reports every year from annualcreditreport.com. Check them for errors and report the ones you find back to the credit agencies. If you do get turned down for credit, federal law requires lenders to say what score was used. That's a good opportunity to pinpoint problems and work to fix them.